Hi, I'm Shay with Delta and Nora Golden Doodles, and I do apologize that this is a late video. We just got back, and I am also hoarse from this weather change, so bear with me. Um, hopefully, it will still give you some insight into these two puppies and get to see them um, and compare them and just um, help you choose which one would be best for you guys. Um, so I'll start by showing you the whole litter um, all together so you can kind of see um, Brooke is actually very much awake right now. So she is over here on this side and then Wade is way over here on this side. I will say, let me see if I can move him. I know it's hard when you get woken up. Um, that he is a bigger guy. Um, so the mom of these puppies is a 65 pound golden retriever. Um, let me pick him up first. We'll do him. Is a, I have hair in my mouth too. Um, the mom of this litter is a 65 pound golden retriever. And the dad is a 47, 48 pound um, Moyen Poodle. The mom is very like, oh goodness, um, very broad and has like a wider set head. She's more of like a barrel shaped golden retriever. Not super tall or anything, but just um, bigger around. Goodness, it's hard being woken up. And um, I think that he will be built like her because he is right now the biggest in the litter. Um, we like to call these, there's always a boy in every litter that's kind of like bigger. And my guess is, here comes mom, say hi. Um, my guess is he'll be what we call the big baby. Those ones are ones that are very, very attached. Um, they're typically, they don't realize they were looking for food here. Um, they don't realize that they're big and they need to be like coddled and snuggled and like held close so that, um, they feel like they're like really loved and cared for. Um, maybe even a little bit, I wouldn't say whiny, but just like needy. Um, so he may be what you're looking for as far as personality is like, you can see his nose is going to darken. They're all born, um, pink. And so they'll darken. Is that the third yawn buddy? Um, and then their eyes will start to open probably about this weekend, maybe early next week. Um, that will happen. So he's our big old chunker, our big baby. You can see the back of him as well. Um, they all look kind of like potatoes right now. Say we're very big, um, but he's going to be beautiful. I love this dark red color. Love his little white dash right there. I have had um, several families ask me about him. Um, none have committed just yet, but just to put that on your radar, that he is one that people, um, just his dark coloring has been, you know, it's just very elegant and nice looking. And so he is one that people have, um, inquired about more often. Um, so this is Wade and then, um, Brooke is over here. She is, uh, a bit smaller than him. So I'd say they're probably full grown will be about a 10 pound difference. I don't know that that's something that's going to be huge. Like proportionally speaking, I don't think it will be that large of a difference. Um, but it is just something to note that he does weigh and feel a lot heavier already than she does. So you can see she has, um, the very distinctive white markings. Everybody loves that for sure. Um, on her face and then she also has some on her back feet as well so very cute um, she will this will because there's such a contrast in her white markings and her dark coloring you will still be able to see this as she grows um, Wade's white marking is just um, will probably blend in a little bit more because it's so small oh goodness um, I do think she probably will be a little bit curlier or wavier, I should say. They're not gonna get too curly because they're F1s, but I think she'll be wavier than Wade um, because you can already see right above her collar line, um, the waves starting to form and his is still more straight. And so that's a good comparison just to make as far as um, what they'll look like 
um, full grown. So he'll probably have more of a straighter coat. Definitely still like some curl. I don't want to say curl because it's not curly, but wave to it. Um, but I think hers will be more wavy than his. So that is Brooke for you. A little bit smaller female. And then I will put her next to Wade here. And you can kind of see the difference if she'll stay. Obviously, he's just um, a shade darker and a little bit bigger. And then she's a little bit smaller with the white markings and a shade lighter. But they're both going to be absolutely gorgeous doodles um, as they grow. So let me know if you have any questions. And I would love to help answer them about these two.